Now you've probably heard, especially numerous times over the last few years, how important getting into nature is for our mental health. So I'm super excited to get out into rural Sussex today and chat to a company who's making it even more accessible for us. Tree tents make tree pods and cool cabins for people who want to live close to nature, all built in Sussex. So yeah, this is one of the very early tree tents, probably about eight years this has been up, so you can sort of now start to see it's, um, it's very much blended in with its environment now. Yeah. Um, but yeah, there you go, tree tent hanging from the trees. That looks <laughs> wild. Like, just a massive bauble kind of... But yeah, let's go up and uh, have a look. The whole original idea was this sort of still keep back camping tent vibe and those experiences you had as a kid in the tent. <laughs> you sort of start to cocoon yourself in the wood. <laughs> that, that little wobble. <laughs> <laughs> but it's also quite nice to just give people that little bit of a hint of you're still being suspended in a tree rather than fixed. On a sort of nice breezy summer night, it gently rocks you to sleep. And yeah. I still definitely say I had the best sleep in these than I have done anywhere else. But yeah, like I, so I live on a narrow boat okay. and I feel like I'm way more in touch with the seasons. I yeah. can get how you'd experience that. You can't really do much else but just be part of the tree, I think. I was sort of into, very much into sustainable design in terms of bringing sustainable design and sustainable manufacture into sort of mass-produced manufacturing environment. Um, welcome to Tree Tents. Yeah, yeah, here's, we've got some bits going on right now, half built in the workshop. So yeah, I mean, as, as a British company, you know, we have a thriving glamping industry here, but it is quite diverse and it is limited. So but as, as a UK company, moving and selling our product out in America is sort of a, a key thing for us to be able to survive, really. Yeah. We try and be as responsible as possible in terms of the material we're, we're sourcing for it. It's not just where it comes from mm -hmm. or the specific thing we're using, it's how we use it and getting the most out of everything. So this is the fuselage. Um, this is going up to Scotland um, for, for an install later in the year. Um, it'll get clad in aluminium, which has just come in there. We're looking about three weeks to, to build it. That's so fast. It is quick. That whole glamping industry is, is rising, but there's also this mental health well-being that people have realised, I think, from COVID, um, that more people got outdoors and more people realised how good that was for them. I've seen these pods in the trees for quite a few years now, um, but experiencing it in person, it feels even more like magical and calming and definitely brings you closer to nature and gives you a different perspective of things. So yeah, I think it's definitely worth a little trip to one of these pods. <laughs>